My daughter has bipolar disorder. Yeah, my mother has had depression uh, most of her life. My uncle committed suicide when he was in his 30s. I live with bipolar. Schizoaffective disorder. My mom uh, has Alzheimer's. We all have a family member with one or more of these conditions. For me, it was an afternoon in Wyoming. I was visiting and Jesse came and said, I need help. I've had thoughts of killing myself. Every family everyone is deeply affected and should feel empowered by knowing that others are as well. All of us have examples in our lives where we're in recovery of some kind from something traumatic. Anorexia, alcoholism, addiction, anxiety disorder, Parkinson's, Lou Gehrig's disease. There's so many different diseases of the brain. We started with the psychiatric diseases, schizophrenia, bipolar disorder, depression, but there's so many others that people live with and, and need help with. Neuropsychiatric diseases are the most disabling diseases that there are, and we want to do something about it. The Rising Star Awards were created under the fundamental principle that cutting edge research more high-risk kind of research would really allow us to find the breakthroughs to accelerate cures for these disorders. What's great about these types of awards is I think they allow for thinking out of the box. They allow for applications that may not go through these federal organizations and they allow for us to get a funding resource so that we can maybe develop something that's profoundly different than what the mainstream is thinking about. These cutting edge researchers do the work that gets the attention of the people who are able to keep on funding them with government money. So it's, it's an, a hugely important step in research. It's become one of the most prestigious awards now in the field of neuroscience and the results have been amazing. And hopefully the goal is, is that out of each one of these Rising Star Awards, we'll understand something fundamentally new about the mental disorder that we're studying.